Hello and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. This is your daily message for all zodiac signs for Wednesday the 21st of November 2018. Thank you so much for joining me. If it's your first visit, welcome. If you are returning, then welcome back and thank you. For today's reading, I am using the Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Kranz. Okay have to say guys today my ears are really buzzing every morning around six o'clock my ears kind of start I don't want to say whistling or buzzing like a, a tinnitus kind of thing it's almost like I can just hear the atmosphere like when you put your ear up to a shell and, and your ear fills with that noise from the shell it's sort of like that but today it just hasn't stopped and it's kept going <laughs> and it's really starting to annoy me now. Never mind, okay. What is the message for my wonderful friends from Spirit? For Wednesday the 21st of November 2018, thank you. What do my wonderful friends, thank you, need to know? From spirit, thank you. Okay. <clears throat> Let me see. We have the Ace of Pentacles. Followed by Major Arcana, number six, the Lovers. And followed by the Father of Cups. Your first card is the Ace of Pentacles. This is a new focus, I feel, for some of you. A new passion, a new ambition, a new drive. A new focus I am hearing. This is um, a vision of the inside of a tree. And here we see where the seed started and grew out each year with each ring. Showing you how old the tree is. All of that growth, all of that learning. This is you in the middle today. You are the seed. You have received a seed from spirit. This seed is, is your, you're being guided to follow this impulse. This new creative, I am hearing for some of you, creative, passionate, ambitious idea. I feel for some of you, it, it's kind of, I'm feeling fired up, lighting you up, ig igniting you. You're being guided to follow this because I feel it's going to bear fruit, it's going to give you growth. Wow, okay. Next we have Major Arcana number six, The Lovers. Major Arcana speaks of your inner being, your inner knowing, your major inner knowledge. The lovers is true love, this is fulfilment, this is a total surrender of your heart, this is you choosing commitment. This could be commitment to another, another person, but it can also be a commitment to your your journey I am feeling, that I'm looking at the two geese, um, maybe they are on migration, so they are journeying. So for some of you this could be a commitment to your spiritual journey, your spiritual path. Whether this is a commitment to your, your path or to, to someone, I'm really feeling that it is 
really a commitment of your heart and a total surrender of your heart. When you surrender your heart, when you've made a commitment, your heart kind of balances out between its masculine and feminine side. There is a there is a spark. This is where you do ignite this spark within you. It, it, it ignite, it's your pilot light in your heart. It, it's igniting, firing up your, your generator. There's a, a real harmony and a union and a balance coming from this seed that has been planted. Uh, something that I really feel is driving you your passions, your ambitions, your goals, the, a desire maybe that you have. Okay, next we have the Father of Cups. Fathers are about authority, they are about boundaries, they are about self-mastery, being your own authority. Fathers are a, a powerful figures, often successful, but this power and success really comes with having this self-mastery by being their own authority, by putting their own boundaries and limits on themselves. Collectively, fathers are air energy, so this father, the father of cups, he is about his emotions as well as his thoughts. He's a very diplomatic figure. He's a very emotional figure. He's really about family. He's about community. He's the kind of figure you would find in the middle of a community, uh, arranging community events, um, an organiser. But he does have deep-rooted insecurities that can sometimes uh, pull him from his path. Sometimes his insecurities come to the surface. Okay, today I see some of you receiving a, a seed, a thought, a, an idea, an impulse. Uh, this is coming from spirit. This is a gift for you, for some of you that are really tuned in to spirit. This thought seed is igniting you, I am hearing. It's firing up your, your passions. You're feeling a drive, a forward focus. Um, uh, ambitions, I am hearing. Um, I'm also feeling this is balancing you out, whether this is you finding love of of something or or someone i'm truly feeling that this is balancing out your heart this is where your heart is being ignited coming from harmony and balance and unity between either you and someone else or you and spirit and you are also being reminded when we reach this wonderful place of balance and harmony, this is the time to keep correcting ourselves so that we can stay in this wonderful balanced place. So being our own authority, being our own master, our own guide, constantly um, correcting ourselves, making sure that we are in the right direction, on the right path. Oh, okay. Well, we'll next have the wild unknown animal spirit. This is also King Crans. Wow, so some of you are feeling all fired up, I am feeling. Wow. What is the message for my wonderful friends from spirit? Thank you. So we have Firefly. I think, believe this is the first time we've had this one. 
that is the energy of air okay <clears throat> inspired and fantastic yet fleeting the firefly contains the light of a thousand stars it's pure radiant and illuminating this high frequency charge cannot be sustained for long therefore the firefly card indicates a moment of inspiration or awakening that quickly fades if we do not catch it there is firefly energy behind every poem, song and invention. Our job is to be ready to harness this creative spirit when it graces our path. What can you do to support this precious and elusive light? When you are in balance, you write, create and brainstorm. When you are out of balance, you can burn out and feel dull. And to bring yourself back into balance, write a poem or draw. Wow, <laughs> this is a firefly moment for you then, my friends. You are being given um, the light of a thousand stars, pure, radiant and illuminating. This firefly is a high frequency coming direct from spirit, firing you up, igniting you. This is real moment of inspirational awakening I feel it's coming from you being in this new wonderful balanced place um, and I'm feeling the out of balance part is the downside of this father of cups he's in um, deep rooted insecurities um, will leave him feeling burnt out and dull so bringing you back into balance Writing, write, um, writing a poem or, or drawing or creating is going to bring you back into balance. Oh, wow. My wonderful little firefly friends. This is fantastic. OK, we'll finish with a wonderful trusty steed, Oracle of the Unicorns, Cordelia Francesca Brabs, whom I lovingly call my trusty steeds. Is the message for my wonderful friends from spirit for Wednesday the 21st of November 2018 what do my wonderful friends need to know thank you oh yes and you are receiving directly from spirit a thousand stars of illumination be open to receiving goodness believe you are worthy of abundance and a gift is coming to you soon so some of you are about to receive from spirit from god the creator something that really is going to ignite you is going to fire you up like a firefly this is going to be you get yourself into that perfect place to be able to receive um, by quietening your mind by meditating whatever that means for you there are lots of different ways to meditate uh, so however that has um, um, well, whatever works for you um, but definitely by quietening your mind so that you can hear that still small quiet voice of spirit staying in balance will also help you to receive this wonderful um, seed uh, impulse that's going to be coming to you soon and being your own master uh, remembering if um, you do feel that you're getting yourself out of balance to correct yourself bring yourself back into harmony and balance Oh, wow, my friends, for some of you, you are about to receive an absolutely wonderful impulse that's really going to fire you up like a firefly. And I feel that people around you are going to be um, under no mistake or, or illusion that you, <laughs> you are shining your brilliance out into the world. 
Wow, my friends. Wow, what a wonderful, wonderful message for some of you. Well, thank you for all of your likes, your shares. Welcome, new subscribers. Thank you so much for your support. You have joined a wonderful family of kindred spirits. And thank you, too, for your warm, kind, encouraging comments, um, especially about mum. Um, basically, with mum, um, her blood levels are, aren't good at the moment, so um, her her INR levels, um, when that happens, she's really... Um, Oh, well, her mind kind of isn't right, so she's forgetting lots of things. So, yeah, so we're really needing to take more care of her now. Um, so thank you for all of your love, light and healing. Um, it's well received, my friend, so I really appreciate it. Thank you. I wish you all a joyful, a peaceful and a truly blessed day. And until tomorrow, my friends, goodbye.